coach 4-3 lost to Toledo tonight, 5-1 and one heading in, and caught a lot of you know breaks to get there and just couldn't pull it off tonight with a close loss. What are your overall thoughts? I like winning better, but you know what? I'm, I'm still so proud of these girls, how, how, they, how they fought, you know, and I give Toledo a lot of credit. I mean, they've kind of had a rough start to their season, but you know, we, we didn't take them lightly. We knew we respect Toledo's program for sure. And you know, they're a couple points better tonight and that's the beauty of college tennis. There's just a lot of good teams and good coaches doing a great job and Toledo just got us, but I'm really proud of the girls. I mean, Kat, that last match, she handled like a pro and you know, that's the way it goes. And Allie Miller now undefeated still in singles at 7-0. and She's been playing at number one the last three matches. What's working so well for her? She's a heck of a tennis player. She was 7-0 and last year, and then she lost her first match. I'm not jinxing her. She's going to get two wins next week. You know, Allie, she's young, and she's getting it. And by that, I mean she gets what it takes to be a player at this level. And... She's got major game, you know, and I always think I'm, I'm left-handed, so I'm always biased to left-handers. She's a lefty. She gets that serve going. She gets that forehand going, and um, she's, she's tough to beat right now. It's a lot of fun watching Allie uh, get it done right now. And then Lauren is just behind her with only one loss playing uh, number two. What does it say about the team that those two have been able to step up in the absence of Kelly and really kind of lead this team? They're competitors. You know, I don't care what sport you're playing, what level. When you're a competitor, you have a chance to win the match every time you walk out onto the court. And those two compete so well. And I'm just happy I'm coaching them. I'm happy they're representing the University of Cincinnati. And, um, they're having great years, and, you know, we got other people chipping in, too. You know, I, you know, we're not giving just them all the praise. It's just they're on one and two, and Allie's taking care of business quickly all the time. But, um, you know, it's been a team effort, and it was a great team effort tonight. We were just a couple points short, and, you know, Toledo, they get all the credit for just a, a nice job tonight. And a lot of great home crowds to open up the season here, but you guys are on a long stretch of uh, road trips coming up. How do you guys prepare for that? Well, you know, last week in Philly was a step in the right direction. I mean, you know, that was a tough trip. That was a long trip. We had to play early, you know, the first match. So, you know, hey, as far as I'm concerned, we're a good road team, and we're going to get back to work on Monday, and we're going to be ready to go against IUPUI next Friday. I mean, these girls, they're, they're disappointed in the loss, but, you know, they know how Coach West and I feel. We're, we're proud of them. They'll come back to work on Monday, and, you know, this won't affect them. We'll be back to, you know, heading, you know, just keep this season moving in the right direction. All right. Thanks, Coach. All right. Thank you.